the light speed quiz in the first round of the Q12, which you're used to. What happens with this then are 12 questions only. So I'm going to ask you 12 questions. But each question is going to be divided into six parts. If you buzz in and answer after the first part, it's worth six. A bit like the old, uh, what was it? Uh, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Uh, obviously, after the second clue, it's worth five points and four points onwards. The jeopardy is the same. And just like your first round questions in the special subjects a month ago, by the time you get down to one, I'd expect everybody to know the answer. So you lose if you jump in. Well, you can see here, uh, I'll, I'll do it with the cursor, you've got the negative sixes, that's Tony on a minus six, that's not what you don't want. So uh, right. if you've buzzed in on six, you can't buzz in on five, you're out of the question. You're right? out of the question, yes. You don't lose six points. Yeah. You're all starting from scratch. It's the top four to the final one. The top four to the final. It's the top four to the final, the cuts at four. Yeah, but if you're buzzing on six points, do you lose points? Yeah, you lose six points. Oh, you lose yeah. five, I see. So you're okay. five if you're buzzing on five. Right, and four people's not getting it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Are all the cameras running, boss? Yes. Do I look pretty? No. <laughs> That's not going to happen, is it? No. It's <laughs> it's not. It's Good luck, everybody. Uh, in the audience, you are not allowed to shout out to that, but you are allowed to go. Yeah. All right. You got that. Constipated. Do to practice. Oh. Yeah. Good. I like cutting your chin. <laughs> uh, apparently, I'm not the only one. So. <laughs> no. Connor Joseph is here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the stingy jokes, you're on the dinosaur no, bike. No humour, like gay humour, is there? Right, number one is this. For six points, Joanne Liu, L-I-U, was elected president of what in 2013? For five points, created in the early 1970s by, amongst others, Raymond Burrell and Philippe Bernier, and their first volunteer, Bernard Kushner. Four. Their first mission was to Managua, where a 1972 earthquake killed between 10 and 30,000 people. Oh, yeah. Clive was that? Clive? Clive's up. Well, that's, that's something. It's obviously me. I didn't bet. I didn't bet. Oh, right. What well, can you swap with him anyway? Go on. Uh, go on. Medicine Sans Frontier. Uh, yeah, Medicine Sans Frontier is correct. So, Ashton, you've got the points there. I put my own one in there because I'm so used to being in the finals. I can't believe it. You've all got unique Father Jacks now, which is quite nice. For six points. No Sense got to number 50 in the charts. Purpose got to number 41. For five points, Mark My Words got to number 33. For four points, and Company, 25, were all 2015 UK chart playthings. The songs, sorry, Daniel. Just a beaver. Yes, the four points, only just the three points, love yourself. And number two, what do you mean? Tap That's the chair for the time. So Daniel's got four points. In the audience, now you're not playing, while well, I'm kind of fucking about here, you're welcome to politely applaud Daniel for his <laughs> Polite. Don't applaud Justin Bieber knowledge, you know, so much. Three, for six points. Born the 12th of August, 1988, and named after another champion. For five points, who has represented both England and Ireland? Number four, a late addition to the 2015 BBC Sports Personality of the Year shortlist. Daniel by four hundredths of a second. Morgan? Yeah. Or Morgan? No. Minus four. I think, let me just tell you, yeah, yeah, minus four for that, Danny. And, uh, and uh, Dev? Tyson Fury? It's the correct answer there, it's a four points. Oh, now, you can see the green and the, the green is good on this. The green is very good. <sighs> Question four. For six points. The Bangles going down to Liverpool video for five points. The Simpsons episodes, Mads versus the Monorail and the Springfield Files. Number four, 
and Mission Impossible. Leonard Nimoy. Leonard Nimoy. Oh. Of all features, which actor who has autographed Sheldon Cooper's napkin? A good episode. <laughs> and my copy of I Am Spock. The book referred to in his soul started. Well, there, there, there's no point reading the last bit to you, is there? So, Michael, where did you go? Mission Impossible. Four points? Yeah, four points. Yeah. It looks like four points is the go to question. So, Michael, there you go. You're in the frame with eight questions to go. <gasps> Close stuff. For six points. You don't like anagrams, do you? No, we hate them. Nobody does. Gaffed Fishy Oyster. G A F F E D, Fishy Oyster. You don't have to spell it. Is an anagram of what? How did you see that coming? Which has been mooted as a potential reason for a baby boom around the 20th of November 2015. Rita Ora plays a sister of the title. Yeah. Daniel. Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> <laughs> it's on four again. The four is definitely the good to a mouth. Uh, Fifty Shades of Grey. And the sister was a title character. So, uh, yeah, I couldn't figure that out until I looked at it again. Daniel. Did you watch that, Daniel? <laughs> yes, he took Sarah to see it, I'm sure. <laughs> Got the scarf to prove it. <laughs> <laughs> Number six. One word only, and the word is not dead. Okay, just to preclude any kind of... The Ugandan State Ministry of Industry from 2011, and the American playwright who wrote The Last of Mrs. Lincoln. No, from over there. Means don't press. Number five. The American author of The Hunters and A Sport and a Pastime. Number four. An eight-time nominated and in 1998 a double Oscar winner for three points and the 100 million album selling exponent of Happy Music who all died in 2015 along with two points the author tell me Evan Star Star no uh, that's minus two points for you Tony I'm afraid right where it the author of A Brief History of Seven Killings, uh, that is Daniel. Marlon James? James? Yeah, James is what I'm looking for. All the people called James. So uh, not much in there. Daniel, well done. Another two points. That's how you won't touch that with a bad phone. You won't have to get in the final. You've nothing to win in this round. But it's nicer, isn't it? Number six. Who was the most famous person born on the 26th of May, 1949? For five points, in Chippenham, Wiltshire. Number four, described by Tony Blair as subscribing to Alice in Wonderland Politics. Number three, oh, yes. Debs. Jeremy Corbyn. He has been Labour Minister of Parliament for Islington North since 1983. I can't believe I didn't get in during the quiz. Three points for Debs. And Debs, if I were you, I'd kind of have a snob with Daniel or something. Do something to distract you away from what's going on here because you are good on seven of six points with a few people. Tell me on minus two. The mighty tell me. We've got uh, Tony's going to be going in for a six or so, and I can feel it. Well. Come on, Tony. For eight points. For eight, eight, eight points. points. Question eight for six points. Good spot. What rank title opposition was held by Ludwig Karstein in Terror of the Crypt and for five points Drago in Il Castillo di Morti Vivi aka Castle of the Living Dead from 1964 Number four What rank was held by Regular in the 1967 classic Blood Demon aka The Torture Chamber of Dr. Sadism what rank was held for three points by Borgia in the 1982 film Safari 3000, all played, all played by Christopher Lee. For two points, along with Darth Tyrannus, aka Dooku in Star Wars. I've got this. Tony. Count. 
I'd love to. Tony! I'm trying to go straight away. They're all fun Yeah, what I say? Christopher Lee played about 500 different counts. It was two, three, four. A lot of counts. Okay, come on, Debs and Daniel, take the way. Tony, you're back on the usual figures again. We've got four questions left. The six points. Misawo Okawa abdicated which title on April the 1st last year? For five points. The previous calendar day, March 31st, Gertrude Weaver was her successor. Ashton. Oldest person in the world. Yes. Misawa oh. <laughs> Akawa died in Japan the previous calendar day at the same time simultaneously uh, to go to Weaver in America succeeded her. So that's a great answer. And that's the first five pointer today. Ashton, you're making things difficult for those people behind you. Nine points. And the stick of other people. Okay. Ten. For six points. A single week at number ten in the charts during a 37 week run in 2015 for James Bay is the highest position achieved in the UK for what song title? <coughs> Elliot. All about the river. I'm afraid not. That's a, <laughs> a mighty minus six points, Elliot. But, uh, it's pretty spectacular, and I probably like you. Good stuff. That was it. That was it. Tell me. Cool. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Pardon? Let it go. I'll be one with the wind and sky. I say it again. Let it go. Say it again. Let it go. <laughs> You'll never see me flash. <laughs> Let it go is the correct answer. Uh, yes, uh, and there was a whole lot of other stuff about the Edina Menzel well, version. I was going to say hold back a bit of first one. Yeah, unlucky. Sorry about that. So that is six pointer. Tony only puts him in contention for the final. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 Moose. Do you remember that? What, yeah. Modern romance or something? <laughs> Thanks. Uh, Thanks to you people in the bleachers there. Two to go. In which country did Barack Obama join Salty Soul on stage for their hit song Saru Yako in 2015? For five points, Pope Francis touched down to visit on November the 25th. And for four points, on an April the 2nd... You don't give him much time in between each... Well, that's the idea. That's the idea. That's the idea. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You know how fragile I am, Elliot. Don't do this to me. Uh, I agree with her. I agree with her. But I want to get done for six o'clock because that's kind of the brief, as it were. Uh, where was that? On April the 2nd, for four points, Garissa University College was attacked in an Al Shabaab attack. For three points, at the archaeological site of Longmekwi, three, 3.3 million year old tools are thought to have been discovered. Two, with seven gold, six silver and three bronze. Daniel? Kenya. Kenya is the correct oh, answer. We were all in there on the, on the touch lines there. What, do I owe you two, a, a second two points? Did you get another two points when we're on the line? No, I should be on the eight now. I thought it was Kenny on that, the Alshabab. Your last question, the situation is... Dyer. Michael, if you get a six-pointer, you'll be in. Basically, Preston, if you get a six-pointer, you'll be in a playoff. Rose, if you get a six-pointer, you'll be in a playoff. Elliot. If I get six points, it'll be a bloody miracle. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, certainly you're still in, but... Uh, uh, you've got to get six pointers. Uh, Mark, Mark Preston, you've got to go in on the first answer. So here you go, Mark. On the 12th of March 2015. Okay. Press. Is that it? Hang on a minute. No, he's got to press. He's got to have a go. Go on, go for something. No, I'm not. You're out of here. That's not a clue. 
But he's got to get six points otherwise he's out anyway. There's more to that than... No, that's all there is. That is. That's a six point. <laughs> that's six point, yeah. That's... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the sub Was it that following? Don't give her any more Five! The five! At last, sir, we must walk together. For four points. With the first few words of the closing tweet on who's a Ashton. Very yeah, of course. On Hugh's account that finished, took death out and followed through the Darby to the black desert of the endless night at the end. Yes, well done Ashton, you get uh, some five. points there. Five. five there. Yeah, five points for Ashton. So in the final it will be Tony, Ashton, Debs and Daniel. <gasps> Debs! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Debs, that's a dice. Oh, I see. <laughs>